So this is a quick look at the Honda ST1100 Pan-European to see what you get for your money and what they're like. So a bike like this which is quite old now, you know this uh, this one here has done 100,000 miles, it's, uh, it's probably worth between what a thousand and fifteen hundred pounds I suppose. But you actually get a really nice big beefy, beefy sort of bike for this. It's um, Although it's old with 100,000 miles, it feels absolutely fine. The engine shows no sign of wear at all. There's no, there's not even any timing chain noise. There's no smoke or anything. It's got years of life left in it. And you get a nice big meaty touring bike. It's um, what, what you do find with them though is that the body panels get cracked and damaged very easily. And most of them have got cracks and pieces missing out of the bodywork and that. This one has also got cracks here and there and the old screw missing. But having said that, that's not something that you can't deal with. Um, it's a heavy bike, you don't want to buy this if you're sort of nervous about the weight of it. But it's capable of going miles and miles without any real effort. And 1100 is big enough for normal use. I know the later ones were 1300cc but 1100's guts enough for most people. Even this old bike, I still consider riding hundreds, if not thousands, of miles on it. So I expect it does about 35 to 45 miles to the gallon, maybe something like that. Mechanically speaking, very strong. Bodywork-wise, make sure that it's um, good enough. The uh, exhaust systems are a bit of a weak point on these, I know. This one here has got a, I think it's got a Motad stainless steel system on it, so you can get a replacement system for a reasonable price. Obviously that then is a permanent fixture on the bike until it, um, until it finally gets, uh, gets strapped. So, there we go.